Two boys in Virginia are suspended from middle school for the entire year, and it's all because police say they were shooting an airsoft gun while waiting for the school bus. Khaled Carabao and Aidan Clark, both seventh graders, say they were far from the bus and on private property. The school board says this was a threat to student safety. Well, joining me now exclusively are Soul Angel Carabao and her son Khaled, and Tim Clark and his son Aidan. So, welcome to all of you. Let me start with the two boys here. Uh, Khaled, what were you doing? And describe what this gun is. It's an airsoft gun. It's meant for shooting at the target, and that's what we're doing. We're shooting at the target. Is it a toy? Yes, sir. OK. Uh, Aiden, I mean, it's definitely a toy. I mean, I've never used one of these things, but people that have tell me they fire pellets, but it still classifies, really, as a toy. Yes. Do you think anything you were doing was wrong, Aiden? Well, yes but I don't think it has to do anything with school. OK, what do you think you were doing that was wrong? Well, we were shooting airsoft guns when we were not supposed to do, because our parents did not want us to. OK, well, let's bring in your parents. Uh, Sol Angel Carabao, your son obviously got a very hefty punishment from the school here. Tell me, first of all, did you know that he had this uh, toy gun, and what is your view of it? Well, I, I purchased the gun, but... Um... I, I, well, I purchased a toy, and um, I, I just purchased it, and um, he wasn't supposed to be playing with it at the time. Um, I put it away, and I, he's in trouble with me. He's in, in serious trouble with the school. Do you have any problem intrinsically with him using that particular toy gun? Oh, no. No, it's a toy. It's, it's actually a fun game. OK, well, let's bring in uh, Tim Clark. Your son, obviously... Aiden has also been heavily punished here. What is your view about what the school's done? Um, I'm just amazed that uh, uh, they feel that they're more suitable to discipline my child than I am. Uh, I feel like they feel they're better a parent than I am. Well, it's, I don't think it's really that. They said in a statement, this is from Matthew Delaney, he's a principal of uh, Larkspur Middle School. He says other children were involved. He said several students verified they'd been hit by pellets and had the marks to support their claims. In one instance, a child was just 10 feet from the bus stop and ran from the shots being fired but was still hit. Another student claimed to be shot in the back while running away during a previous incident. This child was also shot in the arm and head during Thursday's incident. Now, did any of these kids, as far as you're aware, Mr Clark, did any of them complained to the school about what had happened? No, they did not. Uh, they made a plan to show up at the house uh, with the sole intention of uh, all playing the game of uh, ch uh, chasing each other around with it. Um, every single one of the boys was hit at one time or another, and uh, they thought it was a game and thought it was all right because they weren't on school property or on school time. Now, um, Sol Angel Carabao, what the school also said, this is a statement released by Daniel Edwards, he's the chairman of the school board of Virginia Beach, he says this wasn't Khalid's first infraction. He said because you signed a waiver and chose to make this a public conversation, we can share that this is not Khalid Carabao's first disciplinary infraction. He has been disciplined six times in less than 18 months for increasingly aggressive behaviour, including harassment, bullying and fighting that resulted in injuries. Now, were you aware of all those incidents? Mrs. Carabao, and what is your yeah, reaction to yeah. the school making that public? Oh, I, I, I never signed a waiver for them to go public. I, um, I'm, I'm just appalled that they, they enforce bullying, and here they are attacking my son. Um, I, I couldn't even believe when I, when I, I got the same letter. I actually, I, I, that's actually a tweet. I mean, they, they went. I never, I never signed anything that they could release to the public. I never. I, I'm aware that my son. Um, has had some incidences, but that doesn't mean he deserves this harsh punishment. He doesn't. He deserves to go to school. He doesn't deserve to go to another school besides his own school. OK, Khalid, I mean, you, apparently six times in 18 months you've been in trouble at school for, as they say, harassment, bullying and fighting. Have you been a naughty boy? Um, I, mean, I don't know how you, how you feel about being a naughty boy, but... Um, I, don't, I do know that I have been in trouble in recent times. And why is that, do you think? Because I have a little bit of a temper. 
And are you working to try and deal with that? Yes, sir. Okay, Aidan, are you working to deal with your... I don't know what your problem is. You don't seem to have the same disciplinary record. Have you been naughty as well or not? Yes. So you both accept you've really gone too far, right? Yes. So you're both going to be better boys and hope to get back to school as soon as possible? Yes. Well, good. Look, here's my view about this, because I've had quite a strong view about guns in America and gun control, as most people who watch this show know. But in this case, I can't help thinking the school's gone a bit too far. This is a toy gun, and this is not the same thing. You know, when I was a kid, I used to play with toy guns, uh, cap guns and whatever, and, you know, they can't kill people. And so I think you've both been pretty harshly treated. I think the school should rethink this. I think, Khalid, you need to get your own behavioural pattern into a better order. Uh, but I think that they've gone a little bit far in this case. And I, I think you should go back to the school and try and bash some common sense into this debate. Because kids, in the end, in America, should be allowed to be kids. And uh, the, yeah, the gun should. control campaign that I've run does not extend itself to harmless pellet toy guns. So thank you for joining me and good luck in thank getting you. back to school.